in Duke's case, she's been that girl who lived in a small town, grew up in a small town, but always knew that she could go somewhere else and could make it, you know, in New York. And I kind of loved that about her, that she was willing to take that risk and that she had friends from the city and that sort of her deal. And the other thing I really loved about um, this character is I've always been, since I started acting at a really young age, I've always been the one that was sort of like, had various groups of friends, but was definitely not in school with any of them or didn't go to summer camp with any of them. Like, always knew one person was brought in by that person and made friends with everybody else, but always sort of like, was just slightly on the outside in terms of like the history. The fact that she's not exactly in the know about what happened to him, I think he's the, she's the only one that he feels like is not being judgmental because she has nothing to be judgmental about. She doesn't know what's happened. I kind of always thought it was because it was a set of fresh ears that were really willing and wanting to listen and wanting to know him and wanting to know him now being the person that he is now as opposed to knowing him in college when maybe he was like, you know, more together or more clean cut or more ambitious. She likes him for who he is now and I think that's probably what he's subconsciously responding to with her.